Earn Online, 5 Ideas for Software Developers Accept Freelancing 2 and 4 are special. In the end, the procedure to get such income ideas for yourself. Can you answer the short question in the pinned comment after watching? Do you think your friends, with whom you share the video, can outscore you? 1. Create and sell software products. Step 1. Identify a market need. Research and identify a niche or market need for a software product. This could be a mobile app, desktop software, or web application that solves a specific problem or fulfills a need. Step 2. Develop the software. Build the software product using your coding skills and expertise. Ensure it is user-friendly, well-designed, and thoroughly tested for bugs and issues. Step 3. Set up an e-commerce website. Create a website to showcase your software product. You can use platforms like Shopify, WordPress with WooCommerce, or BigCommerce to set up an e-commerce store. Step 4. List and describe the product. Create product listings with detailed descriptions, screenshots, pricing, and any documentation or support you offer. Make it easy for customers to understand the product's value. Step 5. Market your product. Promote your software product through online advertising, content marketing, social media, and relevant software directories. Highlight its features and benefits. Step 6. Provide customer support. Offer customer support to assist buyers with installation, troubleshooting, and questions. Regularly update the software to fix bugs and improve features. 2. Develop and sell mobile apps. Step 1. Choose an app idea. Select a mobile app idea that appeals to a specific target audience or solves a particular problem. Consider platforms like iOS, Android, or both. Step 2. Design and develop the app. Design and develop the mobile app, adhering to platform-specific guidelines and standards. Pay attention to user experience and performance. Step 3. Register on app stores. Register as a developer on app stores like the Apple App Store and Google Play Store. Follow their guidelines for app submission and publication. Step 4. Set a price or monetization strategy. Determine whether your app will be free with in-app purchases, paid, or subscription-based. Set the price or pricing strategy accordingly. Step 5. Promote the app. Promote your mobile app through App Store optimization, ASO, social media, online advertising, and app review websites. Encourage user reviews and ratings. Step 6. Provide updates and support. Regularly update the app to fix bugs, improve features, and ensure compatibility with new OS versions. Offer responsive customer support for user inquiries. 3. Create and sell online courses for developers. Step 1. Choose a course topic. Select a topic or programming language you're knowledgeable in and passionate about. Consider the needs of your target audience, such as beginners, intermediate, or advanced developers. Step 2. Plan the course. Outline the content for your online course, including video lessons, assignments, quizzes, and resources. Organize the material logically for effective learning. Step 3. Choose an e-learning platform. Select an e-learning platform like Udemy, Teachable, or Coursera to host your courses. Create course outlines and set prices for enrollment. Step 4. Create course content. Record high-quality video lessons that explain programming concepts, provide code examples, and demonstrate best practices. Edit the videos for clarity. Step 5. Publish and promote your courses. Upload your course materials, set up payment options, and publish your courses on the chosen e-learning platform. Promote your courses through social media, developer communities, and email marketing. Step 6. Engage with students. 
Interact with your students by answering questions, providing feedback on assignments, and fostering a supportive online learning community. 4. Sell developer tools or APIs. Sorry, the remaining video will play after this break. These are all the places you can find me. Apart from YouTube videos, I share trendy curated content on Tumblr. You will find all the URLs in the description. Let's now continue. Step 1. Identify a developer need. Research the needs of developers and identify areas where you can create tools or APIs that can streamline development processes or solve common challenges. Step 2. Develop the tool or API. Build the developer tool, library, or API using your coding skills. Ensure it is well documented and easy to integrate into various projects. Step 3. Set up an e-commerce website. Create a website to showcase and sell your developer tool or API. Use e-commerce platforms like Shopify, WordPress with WooCommerce, or BigCommerce. Step 4. List and describe the product. Create product listings with detailed descriptions, documentation, sample code, pricing, and usage examples. Make it easy for developers to understand its value. Step 5. Market your product. Promote your developer tool or API through online advertising, content marketing, developer forums, and relevant directories. Demonstrate its use through tutorials and code examples. Step 6. Provide developer support. Offer support to assist developers with integration, troubleshooting, and inquiries related to your tool or API. 5. Build and sell web templates or themes. Step 1. Select a web template or theme idea. Choose a niche or style for web templates or themes such as e-commerce themes, blog templates, or landing page designs. Step 2. Design and develop the template. Create the web template or theme using your design and coding skills. Ensure it is responsive, visually appealing, and adaptable to various content types. Step 3. Set up an online store. Create an online store to showcase and sell your web templates or themes. Use e-commerce platforms like Etsy, Gumroad, or your own website. Step 4. List and describe the template or theme. Create product listings with detailed descriptions, screenshots, pricing, and customization options if applicable. Make it easy for users to visualize their project with your template. Step 5. Market your templates or themes. Promote your templates or themes through social media, web design communities, and email marketing. Highlight their features and customization options. Step 6. Provide customer support. Offer support to assist customers with installation, customization, and any issues related to your web templates or themes. In the last video, we discussed five ideas to earn from interior designing. Here's the video. Also, you can boost your business using these business growth tools. Lastly, tell me your prominent skill or profession. If it's highly voted, I shall tell income ideas using it.